Hello little artist, I'm Mariana Olson and this is my channel where you're gonna learn how to draw easy and step by step. Today we're doing a leprechaun. Are you ready? Let's do this! Okay, we're gonna need paper, something to color with, I'm using markers, and something to draw with. I'm gonna use a black marker but you can change this for pencil. Okay, let's start in the middle of the paper. The first thing we're gonna do is the eyes and it's two circles. We're gonna leave a finger space in the middle. And now we're gonna do two more circles inside. One is bigger than the other one. And then we're gonna fill with black around them, okay? So that's gonna be like the shine of the eye. There. The next thing we're gonna do is two letter N's over these circles. So it's gonna look like this. And I'm gonna pass my marker twice to make this line thicker. Now I'm gonna put two little lines underneath the circles. The next thing is gonna be the nose. It's a backwards letter C. Now for the eyebrows, I'm gonna do here a curvy line and then a letter M on the top. And now I'm gonna do a rectangle shape around this. It's gonna look like that. So I'm gonna do a rectangle shape right here. And that's it, that's the eyebrows. Now I'm gonna do a big smile and this one is gonna go all across the eyes. So we're gonna start with a curved line on the sides and I'm passing my marker twice to make this line thicker. I'm gonna do the same thing on the right side. And now let's join these two together with a curved line that goes underneath the nose. So it's gonna look like this. There. Now let's do the same thing on the bottom. And that's it. To finish this uh, smile, we're gonna do here, I'm gonna do this line even thicker. And from this line, kind of like in the middle, I'm gonna put another one, and I'm passing the marker twice to make it look more like teeth. Now let's continue with the face. I'm gonna do two lines that go down here next to the eyes. And from the left, I'm gonna go to right, doing a big letter U. And it's gonna go around the smile and up there. Now on the top, I'm gonna do a line that cross in a curved way for the hat. Now let's do the ears. It's gonna be two letter C's, one here and one here. So I'm gonna do one and two. Now for underneath the hat or the line that's gonna be the hat, we're gonna do a curved line that looks like this and another one just like that. And we're gonna continue doing the hat, okay? So from this point, I'm gonna go around. I'm gonna start with a curved line, with a curved line. And now let's join them together, kind of like following the same line we have on the bottom there. To finish the hat, I'm gonna do two lines now let's join them together with a little bit of a curve line. On the top, we're gonna do a square and it's gonna look like this. Inside, we're gonna do another one with a little line. Good. Now let's put one more line on the left and one on the right to finish his hat. Perfect. Let's go down and let's finish this beard. So I'm gonna go doing curves and these look like letter U's, they are going all joined together, just like this, and probably the bottom one is the bigger one. We're gonna continue doing this until we connect to the other side. The last one, perfect. I wanna continue here with his uh, suit. So we're gonna do three lines, one, and then two, I leave a good space in the middle. And now I wanna do three right here crossing in the middle, but I'm not gonna go to the bottom, okay? I wanna stop right here. And now I'm gonna close this. It's kinda like a vest that he's wearing. I wanna put two little circles inside for buttons. Now here, let's do the color of the jacket. It's gonna be two triangles, one and two. And that's it. Now let's go on the left side to do the arms. So I'm just gonna do here a little line that goes to the left and one to the right. Now let's go down, down, and close this part just until there. And now I'm gonna go down from this point, down and down, 
and now we can join these two lines together and I'm just doing a curvy line I'm not doing it like straight lines okay let's do the shorts that he's wearing so I want to follow this line that I put on the middle and I'm going to do here underneath a A shape kind of like a triangle now two diagonal lines on each side and now we can join these two there for the legs I'm going to do his legs kind of like bended so I'm going to start with two lines that go diagonal to the outside now let's do two more lines now they go to the inside and to finish this we're going to do two oval shapes on the bottom for his shoes there now let's finish his uh, hands let's do the hands so we're going to do an upside down letter U and then three letter U's that go together and we're going to put a little line here let's do the same an upside down letter U then three that go together and we're going to close here and the little line don't forget the little line perfect to finish my uh, leprechaun I want to do some charm blocks they are next to him and these are kind of like hearts but they are not close to the bottom so I'm just going to leave these hearts together well they also look like a number three can you see them then we're going to put a stem two little eyes and a big nose I want to repeat these steps I'm going to do here my number threes they are joined all together and then the stem the eyes are really little they have a big nose and a teeny tiny smile I want to do one more here on the right and this part of the video is going a little faster but remember you can always stop the video to copy or finish what we're doing two little eyes a big nose and a smile the stem is the last step and there that's it we finished this leprechaun here's where you're gonna stop the video to finish what you're doing and now my favorite part is coming let's color Okay, little artist that's it for today's video here is where you can see the colors I use also if you really like this video don't forget to subscribe to watch more lessons step by step like this one see you next time